Hi everybody, this is Mr. Folly, and welcome to podcast 9.1, where we're going to state the kinetic maker theory, describe molecular motion, explain how molecular forces affect the state of matter, distinguish between potential energy and kinetic energy, and explain why evaporation is a cooling process. So, happy almost Valentine's Day. Kinetic molecular theory, a theory explains. So remember, we're going to explain how particles move. or explain all matter is made of tiny particles these particles are in constant motion so this explains all the stuff that we have because the particles are moving jumble 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 and then oh look you built a little house lego smoke what is the motion of solids liquids and gas solids just vibrate together they're condensed they're next to each other shake 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 liquids roll over each other and they're also condensed condensed means they're next to each other very tight Liquids are next to each other, and they roll in all kinds of different places. And again, they're condensed, packed together. Gases shoot all over, um, ignoring each other. They're uncondensed. And this actually isn't a very good picture because there's even more space than this. So again, vib vibrate, roll, pushu. shapes and volumes of the states matter. A solid has a constant shape, so if you think of like a pen. Oh, I can't draw a pen. Why didn't I pick something I could pick? A sword. There you go. A sword has a constant shape and a constant volume, even if you hack off dragons or whatever it is. A liquid has a variable shape, so you can pour it into a puddle, but it would still have the same volume. Gas is a variable shape and a variable volume. So... For example, if um, uh, Jaquan wears too much cologne, so here's Jaquan sitting in the room, and his cologne fills the whole room up. So it's volume changed, and it's shape changed. States are based on potential energy. Potential energy is the energy of position. Liquids are farther apart than solids. So here's solids. Cheat, 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 cheat. Here's liquids. Deet, deet. Deet, deet. Oh, not much difference, but there's a difference. Gases are a ton farther apart. Deet, deet. Whoa. Deet, deet. Increasing potential energy increases the distance. So this would be low. This would be medium. This would be high, and it's way high. And I'm like your forces and states matter. Stronger forces make it more solid. These are very strongly attracted. Strong, solid weakest gas. So the strongest force the solid, mediums liquid, weakest gas at the same temperature. Two types of energy. Again, potential energy is energy of position. For us it's bonds because a strong bond would hold you close. A weak bond would be farther. Kinetic energy is the energy of motion, which is usually heat for us. Chemical energy is potential energy because it's bond energy. Height is potential energy because it's position. Rolling down a hill is kinetic because it's moving. This is kinetic <laughs> because the particles are moving faster. Evaporation is a cooling process. So evaporation is a cooling par process because the hottest particles leave. King of Hearts has 3,000 people in it, okay? So there's 3,000 people in there, and the 10% of the hottest people leave, okay? So you got all kinds of people here. People, 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 people. And if the hottest ones leave, what's left are, so if, the, if they're hot and they leave, they're hot and they leave, you're left with just the cold particles, which would be ugly, which would be Nick and me. Okay. So the hottest particles leave. It's a cooling process. So what's left over is cold. The hottest particles leave. Leftovers are cold. Review. Intermolecular forces affect the state's matter. Strongest forces equal solid. Weakest forces equal gas. Kinetic is motion. Potential is position, which is bonds. Evaporation is a cooling process. Dad, you're so cool. Toodles.